I'm Meg Geller from Lakeland Healthcare, and welcome to Get Fit in the Mix, where I go out into the community in search of unique, local, and affordable exercise activities to show you how much fun it is to work out and burn calories. In addition to showing you how much our community has to offer, I'm an exercise enthusiast, and I can't wait to share my passion with you. Today's episode is called Workplace Workout, and you might want to grab your tennis shoes for this. I know how busy our lives are these days with work, errands, and taking care of the family, leaving you with little time, energy, and motivation to exercise. Today, I'm going to demonstrate exercises you can incorporate into your hectic lifestyle, even while you're at work. But first, let's hear from my friend and fellow Lakeland associate, Paula Maggard. My name is Paula Maggard. I'm the supervisor for scheduling and pre-registration at Meadowbrook in Lakeland. I'm the type that just do it. Just do it. I can sit here and say I got this, 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 and this to do, but what's important to me is my health. And also what's important to me is to stay fit. Being over 50, you know, your body changes and it's just important to me to kind of minimize risk that runs in my family. And so exercising is what I do to help attempt to minimize any illnesses. The advice that I would give anybody is don't sit here and just contemplate it and keep thinking about it over and over. You gotta just do it. Because if you just continually keep saying, oh I need to, I need to, you'll never do it. There are simple things you can do every day to improve your health, like parking your car farther out in the parking lot, taking the stairs instead of the elevator, walking during your breaks and lunch hour while you're at work, and sitting on an exercise ball while at your desk instead of an office chair. Sitting on an exercise ball helps strengthen the core while improving balance and flexibility. It forces the core to stabilize itself, encouraging improved posture and tightness in the abs. Now let's begin with our first segment, stretching. The following stretching exercises will require the use of a desk chair, water bottle, and clock or stopwatch. Let's get the body warmed up. On to our cardio segment, let's see what Dr. Tracy Taggett has to say about the benefits of exercise. There are many benefits to exercise. We've got physical well-being, we've got mental well-being, we know that it reduces risk factors for both diabetes and um, heart disease, migraines, back pain, uh, joint pain. There's The list is endless. We have a cornucopia of reasons why you should exercise. For the following cardio exercises, make sure you're wearing tennis shoes, have a stopwatch or clock, some water handy, and a clear open space that you can move around in. Let's get the heart pumping. Thanks for watching this episode of Get Fit in the Mid. Although the exercises I showed you today are simple and effective, don't give up your regular home or gym workout routine. Today's exercises only serve as a replacement when you know you won't have the time to do a complete workout. And as always, please post your feedback and suggestions for future episodes of Get Fit in the Mid on Lakeland's Facebook page. 
And remember to get fit in the 